In February 2012, the mission to build, operate, and maintain a high-speed broadband network that prioritizes emergency responders was signed into federal law. FirstNet, the first of its kind, has been called the most robust, data-driven network ever offered to responders, government officials, and civil servants. North Carolina, a state primed to make it operational, calls it broadband on a mission. At least that's how we think of it. Right now, those of us in law enforcement rely on commercial cellular, which relies on the same commercial networks everyone else does. And there's always a risk of traffic overload and signal failure, just like it is for everyone else. Out here in rural North Carolina, those cell towers are already few and far between. FirstNet Broadband, as I understand it, gives us 10 times the capability and reliability to receive and transmit information between responders. Imagine a real situation, a crime in progress, a level one trauma, catastrophic weather, or domestic distress call. A broadband network would allow me to connect police officers, firefighters, and EMS like never before. Combine FirstNet with next generation 911, and I have the potential to reach out and support first responders with public provided photos, detailed schematics, video, satellite imagery, automatic crash notification, and other sources. And I'm talking about data that reaches us before we get to the scene. Like crystal clear, detailed drawing of the burning building we're about to enter. Real time, right now, traffic camera images of a 10 car pileup on the interstate. FirstNet opens up a whole new realm of interoperability for us. We'd be able to easily link up and talk to law enforcement, EMS, and others who might have life-saving information or get to the scene before we do. The strength of broadband makes this possible. It would put North Carolina responders on one robust, liberating platform all our own. FirstNet would definitely raise the bar for EMS. Suddenly, we would have unprecedented data flowing in route to and from accident scenes to hospital emergency departments. Vital signs, real-time scans, images of injuries and diagnostics transmitted in an instant from transport to the ED trauma team who can direct and knows what to expect. In my world, time and information are as precious as life. Chances are, right now, North Carolina's children are using a mobile device more powerful than those in the hands of public safety. And they're sharing the same network signal that ebbs and flows. FirstNet offers a new generation of devices transmitting and receiving over an exclusive 4G LTE broadband network to emergency responders who deserve to communicate without interruption, without limitation. A network able to stand up not only to the forces of nature and dire emergency, but also serve the ordinary routine calls of North Carolina. Hey Chief, this is right up your alley. Mildred Cathcart at 121 Rolling Fork Lane, her cat is up a tree. I forwarded you the video. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? Copy. FirstNet, broadband on a mission.